Hey guys, I'm Chris Buzz and I'm the film score composer and post sound production engineer from Uncharted The Oxus Redemption, directed by Daniello Barcelli and Sarah Laika from Lux Media. Today we're going to be breaking down a few scenes from the film and I'm going to show you guys what was involved in the post sound production process. So in film audio there are five categories, we have dialogue, sound effects, atmos, foley and music. And then the final stage is when all these elements are combined and the re-recording mixer blends everything together. Alright, so let's have a look at a few scenes from the film. I'm going to start with this one. This is where Nathan Drake discovers the waterfall and where he finds the treasure. So we have a few things in this scene. We've got our Atmos, we've got dialogue, we've got some sound effects, some foley. And I'll just run you through it. So for our Atmos, we've got bird sounds and water and things like that. And these are all in surround sound. So we've got some of the front speakers, some in the back speakers. And we can control that from our surround pan here. So from here, we can select where we want the sound to be. Do we want it just in the front left speaker? Do we want it to pan around to the right? Do we want it in the back right? Do we want it in the back left? We can basically do whatever we like. So that's our Atmos. Now let's see what we've got on our Dialogue and Foley track. So let's turn off that dialogue and I'll show you just what this Foley sounds like. This scene was a lot of fun to work on because I remember we needed to recreate a lot of footsteps. I'll play those for you here. I think for that we got a wet towel and we were just putting the towel together and the part where he picks up the mold was actually our mouth. Which is a little weird. Let's have a listen to what the music is doing. So we've got a music layer. Now this scene here, we needed to recreate everything in post-production because it was really noisy on set. We needed Chris to do some ADR, we needed to redo all the foley, um, and all the sound effects and things like that. I'll just show you what we had to do. So I'm going to turn off this Atmos. This is all the foley we recreated. And then we have Chris's ADR and we added a lot of reverb and delay to make it sound like he's actually inside a cave. What the hell were you used for? Alright, now let's have a look at this shootout scene. Now this was also a lot of fun to work on because there's a lot of sound effects, there's gunshots, there's bullets flying past your head. And we had a lot of fun doing that in surround sound. So for example, we've got these sounds here and I'll open up the surround panning mixer. So they're bullets flying past your head. So I'll play all the sound effects and you can have a listen. So with these bullet shots, we've got a lot of control of where we want them around the room. So we can select with this surround panner 
Do we want a sound to be in the front left? Do we want it to be in the front right, back right, back left? And depending on where the characters are on screen or where somebody is shooting their weapon from, we will position that sound over there and then have the bullet go across the room. So yeah, another scene that was really fun to work on. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump across to the aeroplane scene. Now this scene here, there's a few layers as well. We've got aeroplane sounds for our Atmos, we've got dialogue, and there's also something that we call an internal moment, which is we want to be inside Nathan Drake's head, and then with the sound design create something where the sound is flushed out and then the natural sound comes back in. Nate. Nate. Nate, you ready to go? Yeah. So we've got our aeroplane sounds here. Then we have our interior, which is when we're inside the aeroplane. That's our aeroplane engine, which I'm pretty sure follows the positioning of where the front of the aeroplane is. So as the camera changes angles, this also changes. So you can watch it here on the panner. Let's bring in the interior. All right, now we're going to look at the fight scene. This was a lot of fun to work on as well. So, I'm going to play you the scene just with the sound effects, so all the punching, all the foley and things like that. Now let's put in the dialogue. Well, thanks for watching guys. I hope you learned something. You can find a lot more sound and music production videos on our channel. So if you're into this kind of thing, jump on board. Until next time guys, thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.